Once upon a time, in a tranquil forest deep within the heart of nature, there lived a gentle little golden mouse named Dowdo. Dowdo was not just an ordinary resident of the forest, he held the unique profession of being an engineer. His daily life was a fascinating mix of wonder and adventure. Every morning, as the sun's first rays pierced through the forest canopy, Dowdo would wake up and prepare for the day ahead. His home was a cleverly constructed treehouse, one he had designed and built with his own tiny paws. Using an assortment of vines, branches, and leaves, it resembled a verdant castle nestled high among the trees. Dowdo's first task of the day was to inspect various mechanical contraptions he had set up throughout the forest. These devices played a crucial role in preserving and maintaining the ecological balance of the forest. He would check the tree-mounted bird's nest cameras to ensure the safety of the birds and other creatures who called the trees home. He'd stroll by the water wheel system near the brook to ensure a steady flow of water to provide the forest's inhabitants with their vital source of hydration. One day, while examining a mechanical garden, Dowdo noticed an issue. The automated watering system had malfunctioned, spraying water directly onto the flowers instead of their roots. This caused the flowers to wither, leading to a shortage of nectar for the butterflies and bees that relied on them. Dowdo decided to address this problem immediately, recognizing its significant impact on the ecosystem. He retrieved his toolbox, containing an assortment of tiny tools, including wrenches, gears, and miniature gear systems. Dowdo carefully inspected the watering system and set to work on repairs. After a few hours of diligent effort, he successfully fixed the system. Now, water was sprayed accurately at the roots of the flowers, and they began to regain their vibrancy, bringing balance back to the garden and the surrounding ecology. Dowdo stood in the garden, observing the flowers slowly coming back to life. He felt an overwhelming sense of satisfaction, knowing his work had far-reaching implications for the entire forest ecosystem, which fueled his dedication. In the evening, Dowdo would return to his treehouse to prepare dinner. He loved cooking and often experimented with different recipes. On this particular evening, he decided to prepare a hearty mushroom soup. He foraged fresh wild mushrooms from the forest and added special herbs and seasonings to create a truly delectable dish. He cooked using his own designed miniature stove, a small marvel of engineering, with the mushroom soup ready. Dowdo carried his bowl to the treehouse balcony and sat down to enjoy the meal. He savoured the evening breeze and the breathtaking forest scenery. As the sun slowly dipped below the horizon, painting the sky in shades of orange and red, the forest's inhabitants came to life, filling the night with their songs. Suddenly, a gentle breeze brought with it a delicate melody. Dowdo put down his soup bowl and followed the music's enchanting rhythm. It led him to a little squirrel playing a violin, the squirrel's music was captivating and enchanting, casting a magical spell over the forest. The squirrel paused and, upon seeing Dowdo, smiled and asked, Do you enjoy my music? Dowdo nodded and replied, Yes, your music is incredibly beautiful, and it brings a magical atmosphere to this forest. The squirrel was delighted and invited Dowdo to join in the music. They ventured to a hidden treehouse filled with a variety of instruments. From violins to flutes, Dowdo, enchanted by the experience, chose a violin and began to play alongside the squirrel. Their music filled the entire forest, a harmonious melody that felt like magic spreading far and wide. Forest creatures gathered around, joining the dance and merriment. It became an unforgettable night uniting all the creatures in expressing their love and gratitude for the forest. As night fell and the stars adorned the sky, the music gradually subsided, 
Dowdo and the squirrel bid each other farewell, promising to meet again, back in his tree house. Dowdo couldn't help but reflect on the day, feeling it had been fulfilling and extraordinary. This was the daily life of Dowdo, the golden mouse, an engineer dedicated to preserving and enhancing the beautiful forest he called home. His story serves as a reminder that every individual can make a meaningful contribution to the things they love, whether through engineering, music, or any other passion, and that, with heart and dedication, we can bring beauty and harmony to our world. The story has come to an end. It's time for you to go to sleep, child. Good night, and may you have sweet dreams.